splenic abscess firstly the risk factors risk factors it involves the infection infection can include the infective endocarditis and along with the hematological spread next it can also involve uh, due to the hemoglobinopathy that is the sickle cell disease also the immunosuppression example hiv also in cases of uh, iv drug use and trauma next we are going to look at the clinical presentation in cases of the clinical features it involves the classic triad classic triad includes the fever fever as well as the leukocytosis and there is the upper left upper quadrant this is the abdominal pain next there is also possible splenomegaly as well as most commonly it is due to the staph as well as streptococcus as well as the salmonella another feature to note is that it's usually diagnosed by the abdominal computed tomography scan now how to treat the splenic abscess treatment is by the combination of the broad spectrum antibiotics as well as we can perform the splenectomy and there is a possible percutaneous drainage this is in the poor surgical candidates